Greg here from Sticky Wicked Designs. Just going to take a look at doing some minor edits within the Shopify system. A uh, great little shopping cart setup, hosted solution, really fantastic to work with for uh, designers, developers, uh, quite easy to maintain for users or site owners. What we're going to look at first is uh, handling collections. So this is basically like your categories. And we'll see, we've got quite a number of collections here. We've got a few that are marked as hidden, a few with products in it, and a few with no products in them. So the first thing I'm doing is actually going through and setting a number of products to be hidden. When I pull it up for uh, initial viewing, I just have to scroll down and I can see a little box where it says published. I'm just going to select hidden. I get my confirmation down below, successfully updated and that one's done. So I can now go back to collections and we'll now see electrical and lighting has been hidden. I'm gonna eliminate one so we can then create it here as well. So I want to delete emblems. So what I did is first clicked on it from the list here for viewing so I can review whatever settings or information I, I have for this. And Then there's a little trash can. Click on that we get a little prompt that just asks us if we want to actually go ahead with this. Say OK. Boom. Emblems are gone. If I want to add one, so I'm going to add emblems back. Typed in, popped it in. Great. Come and look. Emblems has been added back in. I can now Again, go back and I'm going to mark it as hidden because I don't have any products in that one just yet. And that's it. That one's done. So that's the simple stuff. That covers deleting collections, adding collections, uh, making minor edits. Uh, if I wanted to add products that are already in the system to a collection, it's actually a simple matter of I click on the product listed on the left and it gets added to that particular um, the collection that I'm viewing. Uh, really quite simple, painfully simple. Um, you just have to be able to see enough of the product information to know that it's the right thing that you're adding into the collection. So by mousing over you'll see the little tooltip. And there I just added one in, but it doesn't necessarily belong, so I'll hit delete. It just removes it from the collection. It doesn't delete the product from the uh, the overall catalog. So that's that in a nutshell. Thanks.